I've got virtual reality goggles in the top five VR apps, but how good are they? Ooh, I'm on a roller coaster. Oh, it's a pretty big roller coaster. There's a loop over there. Hey, hey, there's nobody on that one. There's nobody on the coaster. Where'd everybody go? Oh, stop. We about to go down. That wasn't that fast, actually. Whoa, there's goggles like rolling around down there. That's pretty cool. What about these ones? These ones should be falling off. Oh, damn. We about to go down that huge drop. Woo! This roller coaster sucks. It's not that fast. Oh, man, this loop. Oh, look at that blimp. Ooh! Oh, I felt like I was actually gonna fall. Is this New York? No, New York doesn't have building shit. What? what city has building shaped like that? That's Illuminati. We are we in Illuminati? That's pretty fun. Look at those cars. They're all the exact same. Oh, another one. Ah! Oh, there's a bird. Ah! Oh, I'm getting dizzy now. This virtual reality. Get all right, how have those not fallen out yet? Really? I think if this coaster went fast, it whoa, now we're, whoa, we're going pretty fast now. I think if this coaster went faster, uh, this would be much more fun, but pretty slow. And the buildings are shaped like Illuminati, so that's, that kind of scares me. I, I wouldn't use this app again. So that app was called VR Roller Coaster. Out of five stars, I'd probably give it a, a two. How am I skydiving if I'm already on the ground? Oh, now I'm in a plane. Don't have to get so close. Oh boy. Should I look that way? Holy crap. Oh crap, that's me. Technically. This is how we celebrate World Science Day. How high are we? We're above the clouds, literally. Hey, how you doing over there? As he pulls up his parachute, is it gonna work? Yeah, I thought his parachute wasn't gonna work for a second. That's what I was like. Did they put this up? Hold on, maybe I should go like this. Ah! Here I come. I'm coming for you, Target! Not the store. That one was called Discovery VR, you know, like Dis Discovery Channel. Uh, I, honestly, I'm gonna give it a four out of five, maybe even a five out of five, because, I mean, it's just, it's all sorts of different, like, really cool videos that they, and the app keeps updating with more and more videos that you can experience in virtual reality, so. 4.5 out of five. Whoa, I'm already flying! Healths, healths, health 100, kill zero. I can shoot people or something? I don't think a plane can turn this easily, but it's pretty cool nevertheless. Okay, if I can find, oh, 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 is that one over there? I see them. Oh, I see tons of them. All right, I'm coming for you. How do I shoot? I don't have a button on this, I don't think. This is gonna be a problem. Maybe I'll just crash into him. Ah, oh, they're shooting at me! Oh, I almost hit that one. Where'd they all go? They're all falling. What is that? Was that one falling? No, I'm gonna get that guy. I'm coming for you! Oh god, I can't bend that way. Where'd it go? It's up there! Uh, I wish I could go faster! No! Oh, let's go towards the moon. Let's be real for a second. Come on. I love how I'm like trying to lean in. Oh, they're up back there. Come on, crash, crash. Ugh. Man, this sucks. Oh, that's how I shoot. I have to touch the screen, but I can't touch the screen if it's in my goggles. So that one was called VR Flight Simulator, as you can probably guess. Uh, I'm gonna give it two stars out of five because it's a little better than the roller coaster one. You can actually, you're actually controlling something and you can do something. And if you have the right headset, you can actually shoot. Um, but for my experience with this headset, I'm going to give it a two. Insidious chapter three into the, this is one of my favorite movies. I love the whole Insidious series. So I'm pretty excited for this. Oh God. I can't see anything. Holy crap. I'm not sure if you're ready to hear this yet, but we can't waste time easing you into it. Leads me into what? You are vulnerable here. When you stepped outside yourself, 
You left behind an empty vessel. Where is it? They want to use your vessel. Use you as a gateway to the light and a chance to live again. Your mug is alive, bro. The door just opened. Ah, oh, it just closed. They know you're here. They can smell you and they want you. I really don't smell that bad. Whoa, free catering! Breathe. They're coming. That's pretty cool. Oh! Hey! Focus on me. Are you throwing Listen stuff at words. me? They want what you have. Your living soul. The one thing that makes you stronger than them. They're here. They've been here the whole time. What do you think that was? Leave this place! Get out! Oh! I'm actually getting chills for real. Come close. Listen to me carefully. I cannot stop what is coming for you. Well, only you can do that. That's why I came to you. You must stay strong no matter what happens. Oh boy. If you call out to one of the dead, they all can hear you. Well, I found that out the hard you way. You must call out to the living. How? Oh, the living can lead you back home. How? What the hell is that? What the hell is that? What are all these things? Go away. Stop. Stop coming closer. Please. <laughs> that one's not moving. Ah! Ah, that one's significantly closer. That one's tied up. There's no escaping. Even in death. What are you pointing at? Oh no. Ah! Oh! That's messed up, man. That's messed up. I never go through that door again. So that one was obviously called Insidious VR. Now, obviously, this is kind of opinionated because I love horror movies and I love Insidious. Uh, so I'm going to give this one a, five, a four out of five. The reason I'm not going to give it a five out of five is because you can only experience it once. After that, it's like, okay, now it's just going to be the same exact thing again. Um, but you know, it's something cool to, to show your friends for the first time too. It, it was dope. It was cool. It scared me. I, I legit got scared. Whoa. That's us. That's where we are right now. There's the sun. There's a big mountain back there. Satellite. Can I do anything? Can I walk anywhere? What if I try to walk around? I can't, I can't even do anything. I just stand here and look at, look at stuff. Is that moving? Oh, look at, hold on, look at that. I just built a mountain by looking up. I don't know if you guys see that the same way I'm seeing it in here, but when I do that, a mountain back there goes Whoa. That looks kind of legit to be honest with you. Looking up, that is really cool. So I'm gonna give this one a uh, VR moon a three out of five stars because it was pretty cool. It's cool view, you know, like I said, when I looked up in the sky, I actually felt like I was legit looking up into the sky, like in real life. But for the lack of movement, like I, I can't walk anywhere, nothing in the scenery was moving. That's why it's a three out of five. All right, that's gonna be it for today's episode. Make sure to like, comment, comment if you want me to do more videos like this and use this and, you know, maybe play some more VR games or something. But also, you can't forget to hit that subscribe button if you haven't already so you'll be alerted when a new episode of whatever comes out. But I'll see you guys in just a couple of days. And until then, that's the end, I guess, right? Damn, is it cold down here. Whatever. Have y'all seen that when Daystorm opened my 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 snail mail and he showed it and it had my whatever logo in it he was like whatever that's pretty cool if you haven't seen it check it out in the description actually you know what no i'm probably gonna forget but just look it up <laughs>